Hey Ramon. Hey. Do you want a piece of genius for today? Go to Inthert's Flicker. It's the Grimmauld place from Harry Potter. Yeah, I recognize it. Wow. Wow, right? I'm sh we were just blown away. We Did he? Yeah, I want to see. It's wow. Uh huh. It's like no, this yeah. place when they have like Order of Phoenix. And yeah, literally where the buildings are. They have to I hide the building from I the I remember models. that. That looks. This is. It was so smooth. Right? It's like the best Look mock. That. Pop. <laughs> Can we have one? We need one, right? <laughs> Yo, Inkert, you know what to do. Hit us up. <laughs> Incredible. And he also did the uh, the ship timber mock. It's called the Jelly Ship. Wow, wow. <laughs> I can't wait for more of his. Check out his uh, Jelly Ship. The ship timber build that he uh, posted on his Flickr as well. Another very unique, insane thing. I love this guy. Pretty amazing. Glad to work with him. This thing is heavy. That's nasty. Alright. guys so yeah the painting is actually happening you can see we have the painting crew today two ladders uh, I think this wall is new so very fancy finally this room is getting some nice overhaul yeah see nice fresh paint I'm not gonna touch it because probably it's a fresh paint but hey it's it's happening so next I think is the you know cleaning up the carpets getting the actual oh, I'm just gonna try to see getting the actual warehouse done so floor on the warehouse and um, fixing that stuff and once that room is done we can totally move all that stuff back into its proper glory yeah uh-huh so it's happening I smell of fresh paint in the morning <laughs> here's your man of the hour why this is supposed to be something funny it's I panicked I didn't know what to say I know I like I'm like oh, vlog <laughs> hey Ramon vlog I got nothing I got you have to nothing. have something cool and like important to I say got pizza. every second. Oh, there's pizza. There we go. That's important. Oh my god, that's so that's so outro. <laughs> it's funny how Han Solo in mud looks better than you. Totally changing subjects. Charlie told me this morning we got contacted by the company next to us, the ladies that work next to us. Um, a rattlesnake went into their office yesterday and they had to kill it. Snakes. Jeez, Scoob! Rattlesnakes! Zoinks! It's my break time. <laughs> I, I eat, I play Minesweeper. I'm a simple man. All right, guys, um, it's recording. Yes, it is. Another day. Uh, I'm sorry it feels rushed this week. I have really not much time to vlog. I was doing this huge Batman collection video and I feel a bit like cold, you know, it's a bit like getting colder in San Diego. So I don't feel as well and I as much energetic to make these vlogs. But hey, another day. And actually when I was not here um, doing other errands, the guys did actually update the office. So you can see that We've got new tables, so that's cool. There's gonna be more space to like put stuff here and maybe like get some other editing computer of some sort. So the office is getting an update. And the biggest update that you've seen a few seconds ago, uh, while Charlie was starting building the tables, we actually got more tables built and the Yavin project is actually becoming kind of a thing that I can show you. So check it out. So that's a start. You can see the uh, Yavin display, at least the first part of it is <laughs> getting tested by Charlie, it's one third the size. One third, right? It's gonna be nine tables in total. Nine tables, like this whole thing. Yep. Yeesh. All right. Yeah. <laughs> so we just had this room painted. Uh, I showed you before the beginning. Now the painters are done. So this is really nice. The walls are like brand new, basically. As you can see, we got IKEA um, delivery. A lot of tables here. So those will join the old tables that we have stored in the warehouse. Uh, Charlie is building some of the tables right now. Uh, we're gonna start moving the sets and the stuff once we set it up. Mm -hmm. 
this is basically the whole size, as you can see, of the plant Yavin. So we started that, this section here was uh, in the main room for quite a while, it was a test run. So you guys have seen previously that it's actually a base with like hollow space in the bottom, so you can actually fit cables and all these lamps here and all these things, the small things, are actually uh, powered so they can be connected to a USB power source, there's the cable. Charlie was working on some of these um, elements of the Yavin base, so this will be made in more uh, customized fashion and many more of them will appear in different plates. So that's one section and imagine this multiplied throughout the entire table with some elements of the temple, some other elements of maybe some equipment and so on. We got a bunch of 2 by 2s to serve as the foundation for the whole base. And there is more, so you can see we just got the bricks in. There is the uh, one section, those will be consisting of um, 8x8 eight eight plates throughout. Just check out how many we have. That's, that's just one of the orders. That's a bunch of 2x2 uh, uh, two two tiles in dark bluish grey. We need like probably like 3 more, 5, 6, 10 more boxes of these. This whole thing will just be Star Wars uh, Rebel Base. That's one cool thing, I think, and I hope you're gonna like it. Basically, the Ghost will have a central spot, as you can uh, imagine. It's a big ship, it's still minifigure scale, so it scales very well with the X-Wings and so on and so on. The reason that this is so big is because of the size of the Ghost. I mean, we want to recreate the base that feels realistic, that feels to scale, and that all the base operations just look cool in such scale. The Ghost is still being fitted. Uh, Ramon and Charlie are actually working on those panels, so no update on that yet, but you can basically see uh, one of these panels as an example how the front will look like. It's basically a full redesign once we're finished. This is gonna be the best Ghost uh, by far <laughs> that probably anybody is uh, right now in possession of. All right, I mean, just check it out, right? Look at that cockpit. I love this like bluish um, temperature of the light inside the cockpit. I wonder if I can just like take this out. Perfect, no break, okay. So check it out, there's some details here. You can see the guys were actually fitting a lot of the cables inside. And the landing ramp, I think it's illuminated as well. There we go, so some side lights as well. Overall, we're super happy about this one. And these are basically the mocks that are awaiting, uh, you know, a spot in the new uh, revamped room. So you guys have seen those in the shelf behind our um, shooting camera that we use uh, to make videos with. But those mocks have a safe spot here, you know, the X-Wings, um, the AAT, the beautiful B-Wing, everything that we have in our web store is right here, the bombers. Um, well, if you, you know, counting the rebel ships only, those will be actually displayed on Yavin. So those are the other types of mocks, but Star Wars is mostly here. So that's, that's yeah, that's what's going to be uh, happening in the coming weeks. And this small table is actually planned to accommodate the sand crawler, the minifigure scale sand crawler that we have, uh, with some environment around it, so it's gonna be a piece of Tatooine, if you will. And this big guy will end up there. So we're gonna rebuild it, it's a bit damaged right now, you can see some of the things fell off. But hey, it's nothing that we cannot fix, so there you go. The sand crawler will have its, uh, will have its central point in our studio and we're super proud that it's finally gonna be displayed in its full glory. And man, oh man, I would love to show this one, but I'm gonna just put a massive blur just below you, Ramon. Okay. This is so pretty, but so you, out. I'm blurring this out, I have to. I'm gonna pretend you showed up the thumbs up uh, right there, okay? Yeah, that, was. that was an absolute thumbs up, yeah. yeah. Good, good, good mock. <laughs> And that's gonna be it guys, um, some of these vlogs will be more narrative like this one because we really want to share like raw updates on the studio. Keep watching, thank you so much for your support and uh, you guys are awesome. We really appreciate all the good comments, all the encouragement, it's really amazing. We spend a lot of time on these things, uh, making videos and building stuff for you. So thank you so much guys and I hope you enjoyed this vlog, it was Mike, Jack, Ramon in our Brick Vault studio and I hope to see you guys in the next video and in our next break vlog. Bye bye!